Yo guys, Chris here, Ben in the video, and today are the sign-ups for Season 6 of Formula Drift in Forza Horizon 3. We have already done five seasons, it's been two, three months since we did the uh, last one, but we are going to have a theme. Last theme was Retro Cars. This theme is going to be Mazda versus Nissan, so fairly simple. You pick Mazda or you pick Nissan, you know? Uh, so... Yeah, none of the Hoonigan cars, again, just to make that clear, because uh, the RX-7 would be uh, too OP, probably, that's what I'm guessing. Uh, so, there aren't many limits of what you can do. Um, you can only use stock or street tires. If you're going to use stock tires, the maximum horsepower you can have is 550, and if you're going to use street tires, the maximum horsepower is 500. No engine or drivetrain swaps. Doesn't matter if you're S1, S2, or A class. As long as you're within those restrictions, then you're good. Plus, you don't want to be too fast anyway, or too slow uh, for drifting. So, fairly simple. You know, uh, other uh, if we have more than 11 people, then we'll have two different lobbies. I'll do one of them at one time. But that's never happened yet. Uh, but you never know. Uh, so, what's going to happen is you're going to get. Uh, two qualifying runs basically uh, to put up the most amount of points and uh, each run is going to be judged on how uh, well you hit each clipping point and how well you have your speedier drift, your angular drift uh, and stuff like that, how smooth it is. Uh, all that will be based on a point system where you're going to start off with 100 points and then each little mistake you lose or each little mistake you make is going to take off a certain amount of points. So obviously, like, if you drift tap, that's not going to hurt you. It helps you. Uh, but if you hit a wall too hard, or you slide out too much and oversteer, or you don't drift enough, then, you know, you're going to get those certain things uh, taken away. So yeah, no engine swaps, no drivetrain swaps. Body kits are fine. If you want to put uh, that on, uh, you can do so. Uh, turbo stuff like that doesn't matter. Air and appliance doesn't matter appearance sorry uh, tires and rims as I said it just has to be stock or street uh, none of the other ones rim size all that doesn't matter you can do whatever you want to drive train whatever you want with the platform and handling and then remember 550 horsepower for stock tires 500 horsepower for uh, street tires that's the maximum there you can go under but I wouldn't recommend it uh, make sure you upgrade your rotors that's always important if you're using a rotary car uh, See, so yeah, I'm gonna play the track here in just a second. We're gonna do two qualifying runs, and if we have, say, ten people do this, we will go to the top eight basically, and then those guys will tandem. One will be leading, one will be following. Then they'll switch, following lead. Uh, fairly simple. Whoever gets the most points moves on. They're usually about an hour long in total. It is going to be Saturday, June 2nd at 2 p.m. Eastern time. So if you want to sign up, just put your gamer tag and put what car you're using. Fairly simple. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to play the track now. Hopefully you guys do uh, join, sign up. Remember, only sign up if you're actually going to be there. I don't want to waste time with you. Uh, and yeah, that's, that's it. Peace. 